Hi Leo, this is Wendy. Welcome to my channel, Wendy's Tarot. In this video, we're going to go ahead and ask the cards what is going on with you in love from the middle of the month of July till the end of the month of July. So that's July 15th to July 31st, 2021. Now what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to look at your energy first, Leo, and then I'm going to look at the energy of whoever it is that you are connecting to and dealing with in love, okay? So whoever that is for you, just think about that person right now. And let's get started. Just as a reminder, this is a general reading. It might not resonate with everyone, but if it does resonate with you, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate it. All right, let's start with your energy. Spirit, show me the energy of Leo in regards to love for the second half of July 2021. Hi Leo, first card we have for you, the star upright, the five of pentacles in reverse, the sun card in reverse, and the wheel of fortune upright. Leo, it feels to me like you're wanting someone back or you're wanting someone to return back to you. It feels to me like you're hoping for um, some kind of reconciliation. Um, we do have the Five of Pentacles in reverse, so that represents someone returning back to you. And the star means, you know, wishing on a star, um, praying for something, wishing for something, hoping for something here. Um, the sun is in reverse, so there might have been some sort of missed opportunity or what you feel is a missed opportunity. And we do have the Wheel of Fortune upright, so I feel like you want some sort of change, okay? You want things to, to turn around for you. All right, let's clarify these cards, okay? Spirit, give me some clarification here for these cards, starting with the star. And we have Nine of Pentacles in Reverse, the Three of Pentacles in Reverse. My, there might have been a third party situation for some of you. Six of Swords Upright and the Hermit card in Reverse. So you want to be in a relationship with someone because the star here is connected to the nine of pentacles in reverse, which is the card of being in a relationship. So I feel like you want to be in a relationship with someone or you want to be back in a relationship with someone. Um, this person might have left you for someone else for a third party. That's going to be for some of you, not all of you. Um, the three of pentacles in reverse does represent something was not working. Communication was faulty. You know, communication was not good between you and someone else you two weren't um, agreeing with each other and it caused the separation um, we have the six of swords here there might be distance between you and this person they might be far away from you they might have walked away from you also yeah they left you or they abandoned you um, and the Hermit card in reverse, um, you've been searching for something that you lost. And I, I'm guessing it's this person who you lost and you've been searching to, to recover what you've lost. Um, you want something to return back to you again with the Wheel of Fortune. All right, let's look at the energy of whoever it is that you're dealing with in love, Leo. Spirit, please show me the energy of the person Leo is connecting to in love. Thank you. Thank you. 
And we have Nine of Pentacles in reverse. Okay, that's the same card you had there. The Hierophant in reverse. Ooh, someone had commitment issues here. Seven of Pentacles in reverse. Someone gave up on you. King of Cups in reverse. They were holding back from you emotionally. So, um, for some of you, this person was in a relationship with you, but they were feeling... They were feeling unhappy. They were feeling unsatisfied. You know, they were having trouble committing themselves to you. Or maybe this person just has trouble in general committing themselves to anyone. Seven of Pentacles in reverse. They gave up. It was too much for them. It, it was overwhelming for them. Um, the responsibility or the pressure or just this, whatever. Maybe they had to sacrifice things and it was, you know... It was too much for them to handle. Could be many things. So let's go ahead and clarify. Spirit, clarify this energy starting with the Nine of Pentacles, please. We have the death card in reverse so it's not over for them okay they might have walked away from you they might have acted like they gave up on you but it's just an act they, they're still thinking about you they're still feeling attached to you okay clarify the hierophant please we have the lovers in reverse this person might be scared of relationships it's scary for them to be in a relationship. Clarify the Seven of Pentacles. Five of Wands here. So this can be conflict, um, but it can be internal conflict, just like, you know, conflict within themselves, or it could be conflict with you. Maybe they felt like you two weren't agreeing with each other. There was a lot of differences between you two. A lot of differences in opinions. Um, you two had different perspectives of things. Um, what else? Uh, actually, let me clarify the King of Cups in reverse first. Seven of Pentacles upright. Yeah, it's like they were overwhelmed. They got overwhelmed for some reason. Or this person just, they easily get overwhelmed. Um it's a hard it's hard for them to be vulnerable with someone they feel uh, they feel like attacked when nobody's really attacking them they just feel that way clarify five of wands with another card please Ooh, i don't know if that card came out clarify with another card five of swords Ooh, two five of swords or two fives Yeah, this person, it's like they are their worst enemy. That's what I, this card is a card of like enemies when two people become enemies. But I feel like it's not with you. I feel like it's with themselves. Like they are their worst enemies. They they self-sabotage, okay? They get in their, in their own way. I don't feel like there's any real issue here. Um, there's no real issue when it comes to this person and you. It's just their mindset, I feel. And like I said, it's like they just easily get overwhelmed by any small hiccup, you know. Alright, I'm going to end the reading here, Leo. So I hope this resonated. If it did, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. I'd appreciate that and I'll see you in my next video. Alright, bye Leo. Take care.